hello guys welcome to solving solutions on branch and now we are here solutions to all your solving problems it's nine seven in class again today i've been on today's tutorial we are going to show you how to cast transets using um, arcgis pro now this will be a comparison to the result or the output we add them um, using qgis right good so we come to toolboxes and then we search for transects good so generate transects along lines right good it calculates or creates rather perpendicular transect lines at a regular interval along lines so we have that to be the tool and then our input will definitely be what the baseline and then by default we are going to use that output feature class and now we have the distance between the transects now um in qgis we basically used what the different vertices right good the transects were um, determined um, at the different vertices now we have an option to impute the distances between the transects so if you have them um, um, if you want to determine the transects at regular interval this can help you so let's say we are using them um, 100 meters sorry so let's say we are using 100 meters right good as um, the distances between successive or the um, transects that will be cast right and then for the transect length which we also add in qgis so let's say we need it um, to be 25 meter long right good so 25 meter long to this side 25 meter long to this side right good however we do not see the option to determine if it will be to the left or to the right or both left and right right good so the output we are going to see very soon so now this other option is also very important that um, if we leave it unchecked it will not generate the transect at the start and end you know when you now have it at a regular interval you should also have the transect cast what at the start and end so that's what it means so let's specify that so we click on run good so we have an output we can take that out and then we can see that we have from the beginning to the end we have some what transect cast and then we now have what at regular interval so you now see that after the regular interval of 100 meters this other distance is not up to 100 however because we have left this checked it has what um, generated the transect at what the end alongside at what the beginning right good so we have shown you um practically how you can use this um generate them um, transect along line tool in um, agis pro to what to generate what your perpendicular distances along what your line right good so we are going to see you on the next tutorial and sure you keep staying safe and have a very good time bye